Hey everyone, this is Sal Congeloso from Geek.com and I have the Amazon Fire Phone here. Uh, well, I wanted to do a quick demo of the operating system. Uh, you've probably seen it before through uh, different Fire devices, but it is slightly different on the Fire Phone, so I figured it'd be worth checking out. First off, you have your dynamic perspective home screen. That's going to be a, a really big change from anything else on the market right now. So. Pretty cool. I don't know if it's something that like I'm gonna get much appreciate, appreciation out of every day, but uh, now and then it is fun to see. Most of the time you're gonna launch into your icon screen. Again, you can kind of see the dynamic perspective there, but uh, it's, it's pretty minimal. More often than not, you're just gonna to wanna to click on your browser or your email, something to that effect. This is not side to side scrolling here. You're really just going down to see more icons. You can flip up or however you want to call it and this will give you your recently used like uh, your camera, shop Amazon, Firefly, your email. So those are really big icons in the sort of the, that Fire or Kindle style, I guess Fire style at this point. Uh, then you also have your phone, messaging, email, Silk which are your your main apps. The, uh, the main thing here, this is like essentially your home screen, is you do have large icons with dynamic perspective, which will launch you into the app, obviously. The, uh, the cool thing here is that under the main icon, you have functions that are going to shortcut to things that are uh, most likely that you're going to want or you know, deem it by Amazon. So if I recently used Fire, Firefly, it's going to show me the things that I recently identified, like uh, this case of water or this phone number. Uh, if I go to email, it'll say, hey, I emailed Sal Congeloso. So I could pull, I can go right into that. And uh, same with each one of the apps, my notepad, uh, you know. So you're getting the main icon, the bottom icons, and then this sort of added value here. Uh, that's sort of the trade off for not having a full page of icons, but if you want that, it is just click the home screen, or the home button, whatever, and you go there. Uh, from the home button and from almost all screens, you can cl you could shift over. Okay, so I can't go this I can't go this way, but it's not going to give me that much information. Usually, it's just something like the weather and my location, which I frankly knew anyway. But you know, there isn't a lot happening right now. It's just I don't have my calendar set up, but. Primarily, you're going to be going up and down and then coming in from the left. And that's going to give you your shortcuts to the main Amazon stuff. So apps and web, music, videos, those sort of things. And this can be pretty handy. You get the prime button there, which, uh, you know, you likely be using a lot. With, uh, prime is one of the main drawers of the Fire Phone. You do get a year free when you sign up. If you double tap the home screen, you go to your quick switch, so this is uh, recently opened apps, but you know what, it's, you can see, it's the same stuff you have there. So really, you're only gonna be using this if you're from, if you're within an app, say email in this case, then you're gonna go over here. And you can get rid of them the way you can with uh, most mobile operating systems, or you could just launch them, then you get a nice quick launch. The uh, Similar to the other Android devices, you can pull down from the top, and what you're going to get there is uh, recent alerts, you know, uh, things that need manual updates, say, your brightness, your settings, your Bluetooth, turn your flashlight on or off, uh, airplane mode, of course, and then uh, the, the big thing here is you have access to Mayday. So uh, this is the Amazon Live Help screen, and if I press connect right here, uh, I would be given a video conference with an Amazon assistant. So uh, that, that's really cool if you do need help with your phone and you're, you, you don't want to look it up or you're just, you're just stuck and you want someone to help you out. So all that stuff's re really easy to get to. Anyway, yeah, so that's a uh, quick overview of the Amazon Fire Phone mobile operating system. It's, uh, it's pretty slick. I don't know that I like it any more than... Uh, any other options? In fact, I probably like it less than uh, Android 4.4 or uh, or iOS, but uh, gets the job done. 
it's full featured and it's uh, quite stable. So it's ready to go if you're looking for a new phone. This is South Angeloso from Geek.com. Thanks for watching.